Walk the Block is a project which grew from the enthusiasm young people have shown for our annual Big Fit Walk event. Young people were involved in all aspects of development throughout the project. A project like Walk the Block is really important because it involves um, the local community trying to get pupils more active, including their families as well. The idea was that we put the leaflets out to all the school pupils in the area and then they would pass it on to neighbours that maybe didn't have um, any children themselves. Uh, well, Walk the Block project is where we're, they're encouraging children and all the people around Rangemouth to walk, have a walk and you can get ex be exercised and keep yourself healthy. So the project would get passed from hands to hands and then hopefully the community would be using the, the um, Walk the Block initiative and then in effect getting everybody more active and using walking as a really good form of physical activity. We had four schools turn up, um, five including Ox Gang, so that was um, Sacred Heart, Bean Cross, Bow House and Murray and Ox Gang. And um, they all came along with their pupil council and Bow House also brought some extra classes along. So we maybe had about 50 pupils come along today and then they all went out for their walk with some fruit, some water and they had a, a speech from the, the local councillor as well, which was great. Without further ado, I would like to formally launch the Walk the Block initiative. Congratulations. Jupiter Walk! Yay! Yay! That's the Jupiter Walk officially open! Yes. Oh, yes. Yes. Work. Yes. Yay! And Town Walk for Murray Primary School. They helped with this. Very well done. Yay! Yay! And Dundas Walk, which was organised by Bow House. Yay! Well done. Yay! The Burnbank Walk Bean Cross. That's brilliant. See, like when you get older, like this walk, me and my friends and, and the people cancelled designed it. Because it's it's not just one part of Greensmith, like just down the town. It's like the Dundas and like where the Bean Cross is and down like down there the park and stuff. So I think a lot of people will find it handy just to go around. Walk the block has four interlinked routes allowing people to start with a short route and take longer walks as they build up their stamina and improve their health. But we thought it was just going to be something quite wee but started uh, like getting into something big and it's going right through the community and it's going to, um, it, loads of people are going to take part in it. I think the kids have really enjoyed uh, the walk today. It was an awful lot. They were really, really enthusiastic. Um, I thought it brought an awful lot of uh, awareness to, to people. Uh, people were stopping us, asking us what was happening. Yeah. It's amazing, like, in the time that we've done it, how we've made up the whole walk. I designed the, like, the shoes, walk a mile, make your shoes smile. Uh, so uh, part of the, and the traffic lights for the little leaflet we hand, we hand around to school. People. We've just done a bit of town walk and the burn bank walk because we were putting up the stickers and that so we haven't done um, the Dundas walk and Jupiter. the Jupiter walk, that's it. Well, um, we, we went around the Dundas walk in the pouring rain and stuck up stickers and it was, it, it was really, really fun and just, we just got to bond with everybody really. We, roll, we will be going to roll this out to two other areas in, in Falkirk. Big Fit Walk is now in its seventh year and in 2009, 8,229 people took part. In 2010, anyone anywhere can join in to help us hit our 10,000 walker target 
and help spread the word about the health benefits of walking. Just Google Big Fit Walk for how you can join in. It was very much people orientated within the schools in Grangemouth, which means that it's going to be a bit more successful because they will then promote it within their own families and their own community. You could walk the block in your area too.